how to fix asus tough gaming f15 not turning on hello everyone welcome to this video where i'm going to show you how you can easily fix the booting issue in asus tough gaming f15 so if your computer encounters issues with booting or display a black screen after booting you can refer to these solutions so in this scenario one prior to experiencing the problem if you had disconnected the battery interface replace the memory or performed an embedded controller reset for that you can click on this link and you can get the full solution in the second scenario uh, prior to experiencing the problem if you had updated the bios and encountered a failed bios update such as the forced shutdown resulting in the inability to access the windows operating system during startup you can check out the full solution on this link if you haven't encountered the aforementioned scenarios you can find some of the troubleshooting methods to reboot your failure so in this scenario one the following troubleshooting steps are only applicable if the computer doesn't display anything upon booting but the power indicator is lit if you have performed any of the following steps prior to encountering this issue you need to refer the instructions below first of all you need to try to uh, disconnect the battery interface or replace the battery replacing battery memory modules with different capabilities or brands perform a cmos reset to restore the hardware in your computer to its default state you can refer to the following article to learn how to clear the cmos if you have performed any of the above three operations your computer needs to undergo a complete memory training during the next boot up so if you fall in the second scenario then you just have to follow these instructions if you are in the third scenario then you can also read the uh, scenario third troubleshooting methods so i will put the link of this support faq page down in the description so whichever type of problem you are facing at the time of booting your asus device uh, you can follow these steps or the troubleshooting methods in order to fix that specific or that particular problem i hope this video was helpful and if it was then don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel thank you so much for watching